Highlights of Game 3. Kevin Garnett and the Celtics, his return from suspension. Dwayne Wade in the Miami Heat in a must-win situation, down 0-2. Dwayne Wade came out blazing, 15 first-quarter points. That's what they needed. They needed that energy, somebody to get them jump-started, and it was D-Wade, just like Ray Ray. Ooh, sweet reverse layup from Ray Allen. He's got so much tread left on the tire, he could go on like a cross-country trip. And this right here, a reverse jam from Darrell Wright. Miami up five. Darrell Wright came in, played well, gave him solid contribution off the bench. You see, he's showing the hops. Celtics in transition. Watch Rajon Rondo. Oh, the ball faking. He might not have even needed Did it right there. Did he put him to sleep? He oh. lost up. He's really nice. Paul Pierce to Kevin Garnett. Hey, G. Good to have him back, huh? Yes. Took a day off, took a game off, but he's ready now. <laughs> Haslam out to Darrell Wright from the corner. Told you I can play. Miami bench to the rescue. Miami had a 49-48 lead at the half. Third quarter, after a scoreless second quarter, Wade got hot again for three. I like it when he makes it. Now, late third quarter, final minute of the third quarter, Paul Pierce scored nine straight points for the Boston Celtics, including that three right there with 1.7 seconds left in the quarter. Boston takes an eight-point lead to the fourth. But you see Wade here, the steal, and you know what he's going to do with it. Miami down five. The finish. Clean finish. This guy right here has to be that guy. Look at this talent. Jab, jab. He can stroke it. He can shoot it. He can attack the basket. Just got to bring it more consistently. But you know what? These guys, are, hey, man, this is what you do. You do. You, yeah, shoot it. Okay. Well, he hit four jumpers in the fourth quarter to Beasley, so uh, that Boston defense needs more work. That is Dwayne Wade. You saw him gingerly walking back right about this point. Uh, initially suffered the uh, cramps in his cap. Now we're tied at 92. Not anymore. Udonis Haslam. You is, he's so good at that shot, that 15 footer. Just like this guy. Ray Great. Allen. Once again. Huge three. Puts Boston up one, two and a half to go. Now watch this. We're tied at 95. Paul Pierce says 98 93. Who got that rebound? Rondo giving them an extra possession. But Eric, the answer from the corner, Darrell Wright. We're tied again. Darrell Wright played big. He was, he was knocking down the shots. Miami needed that. Way right here on a saddle. I think that he could attack Ray Allen. Maybe it was an injury. Maybe, maybe it wasn't. He lands right there on Ray Allen, aggravating further the cramping in his cap. So he did not come back in for the final possession of the game. You see him in a lot of pain right there. He was helped off the floor, setting up these heroics from Paul Pierce over Darrell Wright. Ball game at the buzzer. Paul Pierce wins it with a stone cold jumper. 198, the final. Boston goes up three games to nothing. They have beaten the Heat all six meetings this year. They have beaten the Heat in 14 of the last 15 meetings. Pierce leads Boston with 32.